Hey Aquarius, it's La Mama, Little Mama. Let's see what messages we have for you. You know the deal. Check your house placements. And if this is not your story, it may not be for you. <laughs> we got worry and humor cutting the deck. Mm. I don't know if you laughing something off. I don't know if somebody's trying to attempt to act like uh, they trying to get you worried and you like, mm -mm, you transmit some shit. Oh, is it earth? Is it egg? Like yourself? I don't know. What we can say? So much just for Aquarius. All right, Aquarius. Cutting the deck. We got adversity and failure. Mm, like I said. You understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn and you accept the challenges are the best way to learn, right? So it's like, I don't know if you had to let somebody know something. I don't know if you're giving somebody constructive criticism. But it's like, whatever you are acknowledging, you're holding accountability, right? For yourself, right? Right? Because you got gratitude at the bottom of the deck. You already know. You happy about something? Because cutting the deck, we got the sun and we have... The Ten of Cups. Mm -hmm. Is it a happy home life? I don't know. You happy about something, uh, Aquarius? I don't know if it's a Leo. I don't know if it's a water sign. But somebody wants to talk to you. <laughs> Is it about a relationship? <laughs> oh, no. Because cut the deck. We got the tower. Expect the unexpected. Is it Aries Scorpio? I don't know. But somebody wants to wait for some kind of opportunity to come in. I don't know if you broke up with somebody and maybe they're like, nah, I, I, I got to get I gotta get uh, Aquarius back. Masculine feminine energy. And they're like, damn. You feel like a failure, but you're like, listen, it could have been a mistake, but it's like, maybe you just had to let somebody go and said, maybe, maybe you want a real commitment. Maybe you're tired of dealing with somebody always constantly in and out. I don't know, Chris, but you got to expect the unexpected. It's going to be some kind of change. Yeah. See, could be about a relationship, some kind of celebration. Aquarius. Mm -hmm. Is it a fire sign? They want to talk to you about something, Aquarius. They want to talk to you about this commitment, a relationship. Hmm. Y'all going to move in together? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Is it a water sign? Is it a fire sign? Because they clearly want to uh, make moves towards you. And they want to speak to you about this longevity. I don't know if somebody took too long. Shit, was a turtle snow slow? With this Knight of Pentacles? Or maybe you were just focusing on, maybe somebody was trying to get something right. And maybe they want to build. And now that this opportunity is here, because at the bottom deck, we have this cherry here. Mm -hmm. Is it a cancer? Now somebody want to move forward towards you. They want to see their victory towards you. Is somebody coming towards you in a car? I don't know. Because, mm -hmm. yeah, they want to talk to you about these payouts. They want balance. They give, you give, right? Got a lot of earth here. I don't know if you're moving into a new home. I don't know if it's something that you worked hard for. I don't know. Take for, take whatever applies, probably for a few. Maybe you're just waiting for your funds to come up. And maybe every time you try to apply for a home... It was a rejection, but now that you probably reanalyzed and got everything together, because you accept the challenges are the best way to learn, right? Maybe you had to cut out certain things within your budget, and now you're starting to see these rewards, right? Like I said, because you're getting some kind of message. Mm -hmm. Message? Who's trying to send you a message? You're getting some kind of reward. That's what they keep saying. Some kind of payout. Yeah, see? You're getting some kind of reward. <laughs> With this page of pentacles, right? It's like... I don't know if you changed up jobs because it's like you're focusing on your skill set, right? And you know, pages are messengers. I don't know if it's an earth sign that want to definitely build with you. Say, I don't know if it's an earth sign that wants to build with you. But you're like, nah, there's certain things that you need to cut out. I don't know if something was toxic in your life. I don't know if whoever was in your life, it was, <laughs> you're saying, nah, I can't, you can't keep doing this. I don't know. I keep hearing somebody failed the mission and it wasn't an Aquarius. <laughs> I don't know if it's a Capricorn, but it's like you had to cut some things out because it's like you're focusing on your happy, right? Adversity. Accepting the challenge is the best way to learn. That one to fly out. Mm -hmm. This your energy. Knight of Swords. Is it another air sign? But it's like you don't want somebody to aggressively say something to you, right? And they can't. Please, they can't come harsh on Aquarius. Man, listen, Aquarius, well, I call y'all the verbal assassinators for a reason, okay? An Aquarius can cuss your ass out, leave somebody sitting there. It won't hit them until like three or four days later, like, well, damn. And Aquarius will be like, I didn't tell you, don't tell you I told you so, because you let them know. Mm. They can't come harsh with you. <laughs> Aquarius. <laughs> and this was, this was down, Aquarius. Aquarius was like, amen. <laughs> and Aquarius, 
is you making the decision. Like, you a cuss motherfucking sideways. Like, listen, you're highly intuitive. You know, you're sharp. You know. You like, listen. You like, you can't pull one over my eyes. And you like, listen, you got the hawk there. Spirit got your back. You're like, we got this, boo. Shoot. What kind of decisions are you making, Aquarius? I don't know. I don't know if that's to do with court. I don't know if there's some legalities in terms of you. Maybe, shit, you could be closing on a house. Hmm? Some kind of decision. Some kind of decision. Because you got choices. Does it have to do with this home? I don't know. Or is it another air sign that wants to talk to you about this commitment? And they probably know that your ass got choices. Something's a burden. And you're like, no. Tens is endings. And somebody still keep holding on. You see how they holding on to that wand? Somebody still want to pass the beginning with you. Is that a fire sign? Mm. I don't know. Because you was popping out, Aquarius. Shoot. With this king of pentacles. <laughs> the knight of pentacles is clarified with the knight of wands. You don't want this in and out. I don't know if somebody's being very foolish. And somebody's upset. You got three knights here. You're not trying to deal with somebody who's in night energy. And you definitely ain't trying to deal with no page. And if you got kids, you're like, listen, you're protecting your family. See? You're protecting your family. You're doing what's, what makes you happy. Something is going to be revealed, okay? It's something that you are illuminated about. And I think somebody is upset because of the fact that you transmitted a lot of energy. And it's like you're protected, right? Hmm. Something about illumination. They know that you're happy. I don't know if somebody knows that you're coming into some type of money, too. Because with the Six of Pentacles, right? See? Money. Okay. It's clarified with the King of Pentacles. Now, are you dealing with the Earth sign? Because somebody definitely want to build with you, Aquarius. Is it a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn? They want to give, you want to give. Are you guys trying to have a discussion that you guys probably want to move in together? It's, it sounded similar to another read that I did. And it seems like it's a continuation. Because I don't know if somebody's trying to fight with you, argue with you, saying, no, you need to move in with me. And Aquarius is like, no, you need to move in with me. Somebody got to sleep over it. At the bottom of the deck, we have this four of swords. I don't know if you have to sleep on it. And you hear that? That's a that's a strong message right there. Shoot, that's Archangel Mic open the building, try to let you know, see? <laughs> Cause with this page of pentacles, right? Ooh, you gonna get some kind of message. We got judgment, we got the eight of swords, and we have this eight of wands. Mm, what are you gonna do? Somebody's definitely in their head about a situation. What is this final decision you're going to make? I'm not going to stop this video. I want you to hear this. You're going to get some kind of a message. There's some kind of decision you need to make. Mm -mm -mm. See? There's some kind of decision you need to make. You at the bottom of the deck. You know what you need to do. I don't know if it's an air or earth sign relationship. I don't know if it's two men that you need to choose. Mm. But you clearly have to make some kind of decision. Somebody wants to send you some kind of a message that not only do they want to build with you, if it has to do with a business, are you going to network with them? I don't know. Because with this Knight of Swords, it's clarified with the Five of Swords. You ain't got time for this mind games and manipulation. But either way, they know you're going to seek your victory, right? And it's like, if you really look at it, whoever's trying to battle you, you're like, oh, hell no, you blocked this because somebody knows that you're protected. They know that you're protected. Now we got this queen. Oh, my dear. I know you are fixed air, right? But somebody's looking at you sexy and passionate. Do you have a choice? Mm. Somebody want to move forward towards you? Or is it a fire sign that's always constantly arguing with you and you ain't trying to hear this shit? Or is it a fire sign that wants to protect you? Whoever it is, you left somebody out in the cold. You kick somebody out. And it's like... Somebody feels like a failure. They're like, damn. Every time they try to shoot their shot towards you, you don't let their ass down. Like, you know, you say, hell no. And if it had to do with somebody else, you ain't trying to hear that shit. That's why you sitting there like, listen, you still holding on. See, Aquarius, I keep telling you, you want to keep coming out. This is you. You got to make a strong decision. But you got some choices. I don't know who you're going to choose. Mm, mm, mm. But it's up to you. Cut the deck. We got children and we got finances and career. Like I said earlier, you have to rewind back. I said maybe it was something where maybe you had to, you know, work on your finances. And uh, if it was something in terms of you trying to get a new home, now it's like you're going to get the green light. That's what I heard. See? Now, cutting this, we have new love and we have deception. So it's like, I don't know if it's somebody new that's in your life. 
a new partner has stirred up your romantic feelings, right? But there's still somebody that's hovering your energy that may be deceptive. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. These illusions is no more, right? But you're definitely celebrating yourself, right? And that four swords that was there too, that's something that's talking about a house pan or remove. Are you moving? I don't know. Mm -mm -mm. But somebody definitely has to let go of control issues. Allowing the situation to unfold naturally. Somebody wants you to forgive them. You gonna forgive them? Mm, mm, mm. I don't know. Because cutting that, you got a new love. And you your own boss. You kept coming out. Aquarius. Mm, mm, mm. What else does Aquarius need to know? Oh, she, Aquarius, you keep coming out. This came out. Ice King. Somebody gonna be upset. You had to cut somebody out. Because somebody upset now because you were dating queen. Let me find out, Aquarius. Aquarius. 